right, so we're going to be inspired next by Mary Ann, who's a level five from Tiverton, Rhode Island. Teeny tiny state, but just as important to the 50. Now, coffee makes her think of the love of her life, bold and intense. She, her hobbies are collecting frogs, and uh, she likes to drink coffee with the love of her life, her very dear husband. Now, I'd like to see now uh, any two folks come up. Uh, in, the, in a second, I want to see a scene that is inspired by this idea of collecting frogs, and frogs in general, because they're fun. But I want you to imagine that the stage is divided into three sections, and they kind of are, because there's these lines. So over here, I need the suggestion of any emotion, like angry or happy or... Any emotion? Joyous. Joyous, excellent. Joyous is this section of the stage. Uh, here in the center, down here is neutral. Up here in the high up here part, uh, I need any like uh, any type of liter literary style. Anything from Dr. Seuss to Dickens. Dickens. Charles Dickens is our style here. And now any type of movie genre, Western. like uh, film noir or a Western, excellent. So we have Western, we have Charles Dickens, neutral, and joyous. Now, whenever our actors walk through these zones, they will be affected by these areas. They'll continue their scene about frogs, but suddenly they'll be playing it in that movie style, this literary style, nothing at all, or as if they're joyous. So we give you something inspired by collecting frog. Oh, this is great, right? Oh like, my god, you got the best collection I've ever seen in my life! Oh, uh, go on. No, it's, it's the best, it's the best. If anyone ever tried to dissect these frogs, they'll put them in a handlock. Oh, thanks, Ted. Uh, yeah, this is a horned toad frog. Nice. Nice, that's the awesomest. It's the best, it's all right. It's okay, you know, it's, I, I mean, it's, it's right. you know, it's a frog. Yeah. I mean, yeah. Uh -huh. you, go, huh? you gotta be careful, because maybe you get worse. Oh, you're right? gonna get yeah. worse. Yeah. Then my dad can lay some off. He's a dermatologist. Well, what are you talking about? Yeah, he's a dermatologist. He went to medical school. He got a degree. I don't he's believe in no schooling. <laughs> well, no, he's board certified. He's great. What? I ain't part of no board. What? You tell your daddy I'll meet him and we'll see who's certified. Are you daring to say that my father, a man known all around Greater London, a man of trade, a man who has put his life to the goodwill of the people, is some sort of flim-flam artist and not a true dermatologist? I'm just saying that I don't believe he breathes in the spirit of Christmas. My oh, God! Tell that to the crippled boy he feeds every Christmas. Okay, I will. I'll tell him he'll be so excited to hear Don't it. Let him know. Let him know. Because he, he does that stuff, but he's not doing it for the attention. So it is nice when it just seems to naturally come back. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to kiss every one of your frogs. <laughs> Duh. Why do, you, why do you keep frogs except to kiss them? Go nuts. Have a make-out session uh, with my frogs. Are you hoping one's going to be a prince? Put your hands in the box and kiss the frogs. Listen here, my friend. There's no way I'm kissing a frog. No? If you think I'm kissing a frog, then you got something else coming. Do I? I reckon I might have something else coming if account of me not thinking ahead in this sort of scenario. But I reckon you don't know about the four snipers in my posse I got on top of them roofs. Who's gonna put a a hurting on you if you don't start kissing them frogs. Well, you got four snipers, but I got three ghosts that are gonna visit you in your sleep. Oh, no. <laughs> them, are them the ghosts of the men that I hunted down? Maybe. They're more Christmas-orientated ghosts. Oh, so they're just, they're just you know, general specters. But you're going to like them. They're great. I mean, I they're really so. good people. They're fun to hang I out with. So. You know, I you're going to have a good time. They're, they're really good people. Yeah. Uh, no, for ghosts, you know, some ghosts are like, nah, but these right. ghosts, they're all yeah. right. I've never met a ghost I didn't like. Yeah, no, me neither. I mean, mm. I like these ghosts. I mean, you yeah. know, sometimes they're all right. But uh, well, they, I, I think they're real know, good. And I think you should be careful when you talk to them. How? Dare you! I shall this very day have my satisfaction. Step closer, and I will lay out this leather glove for besmirching my father, the dermatologist, and my opinion of the ghosts. Come. You better be careful with that there, because I'll be. Yeah. Ah, 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 ah,